Hi, in this video I have a new review for you and this time I'm going to review and show you how you can use the Crew Alarm TV paint stick. Now if you don't know me yet, my name is Melissa van Dijk, I'm a makeup artist as well as having an independent channel which means I'm buying the products with my own money. Now this is the Creolan TV paint stick, it is a cream foundation in the stick form and you can twist it up and down which is also great and I'm using the shade Ivory. Now there are many ways on how you can use the TV paint stick, Creolan always offers like tons of shades and you can even use it as a concealer if you are using a lighter shade or as bronzer or contouring if you're using a darker shade and you just can use your sponge your brush to blend it in which is so versatile. Like with so many shades you can just use basically one product and just do it all yourself. Now when it comes to how you are going to use it there are many ways and I'm going to show you also my like my preference as well as how you can use it depending on what you have at home. First way would be going directly into um, like from the stick onto your skin like this. And this way you can also have a little bit more coverage at once and you're going to blend it in with a sponge or with a brush. Now I'm going to use a brush and using circular motions to blend it into the skin. Now this way, if you're using it all over the face, it can offer like a strong coverage at once and then you're going to blend it into the skin. And if you want more, this is also a cream foundation that you can build up. You can keep it very lightweight and sheer to medium coverage based on how like a, found, like a cream foundation works so that you still can see your skin through or get the full coverage version, depending on what you are planning to do with the cream foundation and also how you feel about yourself using it. Now, then there's also another way which I mainly prefer the most, which is using a brush as well as taking it directly from the stick foundation. This way I have a little bit more control on how much I'm going to use um, and it's also directly on the brush and I also have already warmed up the cream foundation and I just can blend it in using circular motions and this way I won't end up with any strange lines. So for me personally using the version where I'm going directly with the stick onto my skin it can be a little bit tricky and hard to blend into the skin and get rid of those lines because it has such a strong coverage it is a little bit more of a stiffer cream foundation that this can be a little bit tricky to blend into the skin. So this is why I personally prefer to use it directly from the brush to the skin. Also, what's really important when you're using the TV paint stick, because it's a cream foundation, make sure you have moisturized your skin well, as well as also, this is an additional step, use primer if you like to, because this will help you to get you a little bit more of a slip. And then blending in the TV paint stick will also be much easier. Now there's also another way where you can use the sponge. And this is a damp sponge so that it gets a little bit more softer and it's also easier to apply. And again, I like to use it directly from the stick so that I can control the amount of product I'm going to use and then blend it into the skin by just using the dabbing motion. And this is just a way if you like to use it um, basically with the sponge. Of course, you could also go ahead and use it like this and then use the sponge to blend it into the skin. It just depends on what you are able to do with your sponge and brush. If you are able to blend it into the skin seamlessly while using the stick directly onto the skin, that's totally fine, do it, go for it. But if you want to have a little bit more control of how co much coverage and product you are going to use, I definitely would recommend you using it from the stick and then onto the skin. Now, of course, <clears throat> excuse me, because it's a cream foundation, it can be like a very light coverage and also a very intense coverage. Now with this one, you either could also use it for concealer or just use a smaller brush like this and use it on the specific areas like such as the breakouts and then use the finger to blend it in. And it also will help you to cover up those areas which is very easy and it also won't take you a lot of time and I'm still using only one product. I also could use it without a problem now with a smaller brush or the sponge under the eyes. And this is just a great way on how like versatile this TV paint stick is. And of course you can get it in so many different shades, which means you will also um, be able to have it as a concealer shade that's a bit lighter or skin tone shade for your blemishes and breakouts, as well as get that intense coverage if you like to. Now those are those versions on how you can use it with a brush, with a sponge, directly onto the skin, or just take it from the stick 
to the uh, tool that you're going to use. Now, for me, I've noticed that I want to keep it very lightweight. I like the finish of having a sheer to medium coverage, not too intense. But when it comes to the color, um, the way that I've chosen the color is based on what uh, color I've used in the Derma color. And the closest one that I got was basically the shade Ivory. Now, I've also noticed that the shade Ivory is a little bit too yellowish for me, depending on how much I'm using or where I'm using it. So it's not the like um, correct shade based on my skin tone, but it is pretty close. So it also depends on um, if you are going to order it online or if you have a store next to you, go into the store and see some swatches basically to make sure that it's going to match with your skin tone. Otherwise, ask also for samples or any recommendations. Now, there's also another way that I want to show you, and this is based on how strong the coverage is. Basically, the TV Paint Stick is like such a vers like versatile cream foundation that you also can use to even cover up tattoos. Now, I'm not going to do the whole process where I'm going to use a color correcting um, like concealer to first go over the tattoo, but I'm also going to go directly in with the TV Paint Stick. Now, normally with a tattoo, if you're going to cover up a tattoo, because this one is now black grayish, I would use an orange concealer or basically an orange TV paint stick or cream foundation, then do some powder on top and then go in with the cream foundation. But I just wanted to show you basically, if I can reach it, how strong the coverage is. Like this is only one swipe. You still can see it through just a tiny bit and I still haven't blended it. But you can also build it up and then make sure that you're using also enough powder to set it. So you can use it also for your body on certain areas. And then either go in with a sponge or with a brush to blend it in. So now I just blended it in as far as I can reach it. But basically this is how the coverage looks like if I'm just using it on my own with uh, um, basically with no concealer underneath to color correct it. But it still has a pretty strong coverage by only using it also over a tattoo. Now this is what I wanted to share with you. Like this, I can't just go come over it and basically tell you that this is such a versatile cream foundation. It's in a stick form. It's very travel friendly. It's not too long, not too big. I mean, it also has like um, a lid that you can like basically screw so that it's not going to open from itself. So those are really like the things that I enjoy about the TV paint stick. And it also basically is called the TV paint stick because most of them are also getting used, for example, in news channels where uh, it basically makes the skin look so flawless. And this is also where the term comes from and also how it basically transfers to the camera perspective. But also in real life, um, especially because my dry skin, basically, a uh, combination skin. I also like to use it as a sheer coverage that goes over it, not too much. I want to keep it very subtle and natural, but it still does such an amazing job. And this is basically what I wanted to share with you. They have tons of shades. You, If you are interested, you can check it out. I mean, you know their website. And this is basically what I wanted to share with you and show you how versatile this um, cream is. Now, I do hope that you enjoyed this little review of the Creolan TV paint stick. If you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up as well as share it. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you soon in the next one. Bye!